Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Um, we're just really wandering around uh, potential apiary sites and this is another one which uh, I'm looking at placing a hive. So if you look around, so that's the compound behind me so I can fit a beehive somewhere in amongst that fence line uh, which gives access to really what's behind me. So you can see behind me there's lots and lots of cereal crop fields. So for me, this would be an ideal place for a hive and considering that the crop of choice around here anyway is rapeseed. So my intention will be to get one up here as soon as I can um, after doing a split and so on. And they will uh, become the Tarry Apiary um, because it's located on Tarry Road, which is only about two miles from where I live currently. So it's good news. Logistically, it'll be a lot simpler for me. So this is the Tarry Apiary. So initially one hive inside this compound, uh, looking to increase wherever possible. Uh, the landowner at the moment um, is happy for me to, to use this area. As you can see, it is ideal. So once these crops appear, um, hopefully a hive's gonna be here by this stage. Great stuff. So we're gonna visit the next one, which is the Addison Apiary, which is the one um, I managed to uh, secure last week so i look forward to that so i'll pause you for now and we'll see you when we get to the addison apiary cheers now bye Alrighty. Hi folks, welcome back again. We're now uh, in the Anderson Apiary. So we're having a quick look on what the score is here. Uh, as you can see, you've already seen the chooks. They're getting fed today. So that's Jim. Um, he keeps hens here um, and he gets quite a few eggs from it actually. So he's doing quite well out of that. However, he's obviously uh, wanting bees in the garden. Um, which we will try and sort out for him. Right, so have a look at uh, the placement of the hive where it's going to be. Bear with me. So, the hive's going to be in this corner. Okay, at the moment, obviously, uh, there's going to be some work done Let's to clear all the brambles. So, that'll be the corner. So, the forage here is pretty good actually. Uh, he has told me that uh, there's a lot of insects. That visit the garden, especially this huge bush here. It usually throws out quite a lot of flowers initially. I'm not sure what they are, I'm gonna have to look them up actually. Um, so they do offer good forage. Okay, so this is where we are. Addison, um, complete with 
jugs. We informed that they're a little bit suspicious of scratches, and they certainly uh, prove that. They just leg it and leg it new. So, yeah. So they have a snake ring. One more round for you folks. So, once again, we've got the corner where the bees go eventually. And there's going to be a wall down here. Jim informs me also that he's got lots of weeding to do. Well, he certainly needs to uh, clear out this. However, everything's fine and dandy. Great site. Lots of forage. So it'll be interesting. Uh, one of my thoughts were, is this apiary will become the treatment free apiary. Uh, I've been looking. Uh, I've done my study as far as other beekeepers in the area, so I think we're pretty good. So we're going to have to see how this goes. Anyway, that about completes it. I suppose the next one um, that we'll put up is when the actual uh, installation of the hive here. So I'll make sure I get that on film for you guys. Okay, so thanks for looking in. Remember to like, subscribe, comment. Uh, if anybody knows what that tree was, let me know. Um, I'll do some research to find out what it is. Okay, so that's great, and I'll see you very soon. Cheerio now.